There's one. Oh, this may be a good one. Oh, it's a giant. We're gonna hop back on the river, guys. Keep on going. Hopefully get into a monster smallmouth we can pull over and get pictures of too. That's the plan. So he's the one, he's the river dude. So let's hop back on the river and hopefully get on some more smallies. But if you ever want to come out and do a float, let me know. If I'm free, I'll go with you. I've got a lot of people that's like, hey, can I go out with you fishing sometime? Like, let me know when you're free. They're like, but how do I know you're free? I'm like, dude, I'm like, if I'm free, I'm like, I'm fishing. See, I would throw the big Joshy, but I know it catches them because I catch them in the creek, but I'm like, if I'm catching one of Ned, then why? I chose the wrong side. You got the side with the rocks. Yeah. I've just got a stupid muddy bank up here. Yeah. Oh, I bet if we would have just stayed at the dam we started at all day, we would have just caught fish probably left and right. Yeah, we Dang, that's not a bad one. Oh, he came right up at the top of the water and got it. Oh my gosh. It's not a bad one, is it? Dude, that was weird right there. No, how we just both pulled our baits right at the top. They just came up and slammed it. Come on. On mad? Yeah. Oh, look at that tiny little guy. Isn't he cute? All I did, I felt that one bite, but after I felt him bite, I didn't even feel anything. If I didn't just start reeling and see my line moving, I wouldn't even have known he was on. They're just fishing such an area, just like a blank area too, with just a muddy bottom area. Is it shallow? There's one. I was pulling it up, just letting it sit there. Oh, this may be a good one. Oh, it's a giant. Dude, that's my PB. Holy crap. <laughs> Holy crap, that is my PB. Dude, he hit it so light. All right guys, we just stopped over here to get my small mouth, get a few pictures of, dang it, I broke my net right here. But we stopped over here to get some pictures of her. Um, it's really my PB small mouth right there. So right there she is, um, 18 and a quarter inches, longest fish I've ever measured for a small mouth on a kayak. I've got one on a boat that's probably close, but I think this one's probably a little bit bigger. I've just never really went small mouth fishing. So there we go, hopefully my net doesn't float away. We're just gonna get her right back in the water. So. Oh, there we go. That was sweet. I think I got her jumping out of the water on camera too. Really? On video, that'll be sweet. Cause I was just trying to get her up to see what it was. It was hugging the bottom almost like a catfish at first. There we go. Smally. Is that, that's a large mouth. Is it? No. Dude, these freaking smallies fight so hard. I'm not breaking off another one. Dude, we're catching a lot of fish today. It's right up here. This weather did get weird, didn't it? Changed up a lot. I'm just gonna kind of stand like this till you're uh, ready to head down a little bit since it's shallow. <laughs> oh something was just something keeps on these small ones just keep on biting the tail of my ned rig <laughs> see 
See, the thing that I hate, I would hate is if I started just going off on my own and like all these spots just randomly kind of going at it without just asking me like, hey, you guys think this is a good area that I should try or something like that. I'm like, I would just waste a lot of time on something that's potentially nothing. Oh, just a little guy. He was right on that rock by that tree right up there right in the corner it hurts so bad when those freaking spines spike you on those any fish i got two bites right here underneath this tree yeah i mean you can that's a nice one dude That's maybe not as nice as I thought. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Dude, holy crap, he fought real good. He's fat for his size. He jumped at first. Yeah. And when he jumped, I'm like, holy crap. I just saw the bottom flash. This day is crazy, dude. Just fish back and forth. Left and right, these fish are coming out. <laughs> Are those like normal size fish for here that you catch? Yeah. Oh, there was one hitting it. Then I get went straight into that rock. my net but as I was trying to reel it in that's not a bad one at all See what this stud measures. <laughs> uh -huh. Dang, you were dead on. You're good at this. Let's see that smaller real quick. That's a good one, dude. 16 and a quarter. Beautiful smallie. Going back. She was nice and calm going back in there. Yeah. Hey. Finally got a decent one today. About time. <laughs> <laughs> I keep on losing them. Like they just go upstream and then I lose them as soon as they start going upstream. They do those by inches. Oh. So 87 inches. Oh, see, I've always wondered that. There's one. Holy crap, this dude's just hitting the current and running. All right, another fish. See you, buddy. This is a crazy day out here. I caught mine right off that big rock in front of you. Oh, my bad. Tiny. <laughs> well, just the little guy. All right, buddy. See ya. You were a feisty one. Is there any specific uh, way to get down this best? 
I'm gonna keep on going just to get out of the rapids. I think that was the last rapid hole that we're gonna have to hit. I'm coming. Got it. This thing went airborne like. I just took a freak. Holy crap! This thing went airborne like five times, dude. It was insane. Just so you know, I took a freaking dive for you. I almost threw my camera in the water. I luckily I tossed it up. Let's see this sucker. Dude, that is a tank. That is an absolute tank. Did you measure it yet? Holy crap. Mm. All right. 18 and three quarter. 18 three quarter to 19 inch. Yeah, I could probably stretch her if I. 18 three quarters. No, that one hit 19. It looked like mouth was closed too. All right, let's see the sucker one more time. Oh my gosh, dude. That is a tank. We're going to get some pictures of her. We'll be right back for the release, guys. Beast. Man, that is a sweet fish. All right, girl, you're good. There she goes. Man, that was a beast. Yeah, bud. So I know you guys didn't see. I went down. Well, you guys may have. I went down these rapids right here. He's got an anchor. I don't. So I couldn't stay right here with him. So I went down and uh, stayed at the bottom and he, I heard him yelling, I see him hooked up and I'm like, crap, what am I gonna do? So I put my kayak right over at the bank, ditch it real quick, almost dropped my camera um, in the water. I think my GoPro may have gotten in the water, but it's okay, it's waterproof. And my phone got in the water a little bit. So I just threw them there real quick and took off running the bank up here to get that fish for Ryan. Thank so you, thank you. That was a sweet fish. Definitely loving the river so far, thanks to this guy right here. So he's he's the river master right here. That thing went airborne like five times, dude. In the current, jumped two, three times. Insane fight. Probably <laughs> all about a minute and a half too. It took me to land that girl. Yeah, that's what I know. He when he yelled, I took off over here, and he was fighting it every single second till about when right when I got here. Yeah. Then he finally got it in but sweet, we're gonna hop back on the kayaks. I gotta walk down to mine again. And then uh, we got just a little bit left, probably half a mile or so. Mile. Half a mile, to three, maybe three quarter miles. So we got a little bit left to go. So let's get back on the kayaks. Yeah, I was fishing this current right as soon as you said that. Oh, holy. Okay. No, it's a decent one. No, it's small. He was fighting. Thing I don't do. What? Once I know I've got a good one, I kind of just I kind of He jumped into the net for me. Like I don't do this area compared to bait. Yeah. Just a lot more bait. Now after today you probably like this stretch fairly well now too. Well, we are loading up now. Um, just pulled off. What, 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 did we, what did we think we did? Probably about 11 hour float? About 11 hours was total length. Seven miles or so? Yeah, I think seven miles. Seven miles, so pretty good float today. Had a lot of fun, thanks to Ryan. I've been wanting to fish this uh, river here for a while, but I had no idea where to start. So I'm like, hey, I'm like, you mind going out with me? Um, he brought me out. I just told him like I don't care about any secret spots. I'm like, <laughs> like we don't need to do that because as you guys know that watch these videos, uh, you guys may steal these spots. So, <laughs> anyways, I just told him like let's just go out to a spot to where don't have to worry about anybody really stealing spots or anything. Just go possibly catching fish. Came out here, turned out to be an awesome we day. We caught them. We caught a lot of fish today. Curse so tore them up. Hey, Not you're the, more than I did too, you, I think. You caught the biggest though. Yeah. So he got the biggest like 19 inches or so. Yeah, 19. So anyways, hopefully you guys enjoyed today's video. Uh, we should be out here with Ryan some more this fall. Smallmouth fishing hopefully. 
So anyways, we will see you guys in the next video. Thank you guys for watching.